what's up guys welcome to my channel today i'm going to be showing you guys how i got my potato pc to work valorant at 70 to 80 fps let me show you how right after this intro Okay guys, so before we start the video, you need to have the minimum requirements for Valorant to run on your PC. So these right here are the minimum requirements for Valorant and these are my requirements. Now people, when you go to other people's channel, they will tell you that you need uh, 8 GB RAM to use it or else it won't work. Well, I personally have 4 GB RAM as you guys saw and I can run it at 70 to 80 FPS which is pretty good so this is how you do it okay guys so first we are going to go to our video settings now in the first video settings you want to keep your display to full screen resolution to less than your um, actual uh, monitor resolution and all of these fps limiters keep them at off so that you can get the most fps now in the graphics you want to obviously keep all of them at lowest so uh, you don't hurt your PC when playing Okay guys, so before we start doubling our RAM remember that this doesn't actually double your actual RAM Because that would be crazy if you could actually uh, double our RAM This doubles your VRAM and what that does is increase your gaming performance and gives you a little more FPS Okay guys, so to this uh, we need to go to your file, right click and go to properties. Now check your RAM and then go to advanced system settings. Now inside advanced system settings you want to press to properties, go to advanced and press change. Now here you see the 6144 things, yeah that's where you need to do your thing. So I already did this, so this is what I'm going to show you. So you need to go to your calculator, you know what a calculator is so you need to put your uh, initial ram size into 1024 now the answer you get you have to multiply that by 1.5 so now you have to take this and put it on both of those places right there press set press ok now it will ask you to restart your pc so you have to restart it and then you should be uh, you should have increased your vram Okay guys, so to decrease the resolution quality, we need to go to the game user settings of Valorant. So go to users, go to your name, go to app data, go to local and find Valorant. So I found it. Now in Valorant, go to saved, go to config and now here, instead of doing it, I'm just going to search it up there. I'm going to search game user settings dot ini. So now here we are going to uh, right click them go to its properties and set it off from read only now we are going to open them okay so after you open it check for resolution quality and now here you need to put it to 90 70 or 80 depending on how bad your pc is i put it to 90 and don't forget to put it to read only after setting them so the resolution quality actually decreases the resolution of your game and it helps by increasing FPS as it doesn't have to be a pain in the air for your graphics card. So this increases the FPS as it has to uh, decrease the amount of pixel it renders out. Okay guys so we are finally at the last step. So the last step is that changing the priority. So changing the priority actually um, it prioritizes the app more than any other app that's running so go to the details and task manager and now scroll down until you find valorant valorant starts with v so it has to be at the last right so find valorant win 64 shipping or something go to change priority and put it to real time or high so change priority and that's it so now just go and enjoy your smooth fps okay guys so my obs recording of my valorant was really laggy so i recorded it with a phone instead and this uh, captures my uh, uh, benchmark of valorant um, about how much i uh, how much fps i got so have a look at it and see how much fps i'm getting
thanks for watching guys hope you guys made it till the end of the video and hopefully your valorant is a little boosted uh, so if it helped you out please leave a like comment and subscribe and i'm gonna be streaming soon so hopefully i get i can meet you guys there so yeah until next time bye bye and peace out